ഹലോ ഫ്രണ്ട്സ് ഐ എം ഡോക്ടർ ജ്യോതിദേവ് കേശവദേവ് എ ഡയബറ്റോളജിസ്റ്റ് വർക്കിംഗ് ഇൻ കേരള ഹാസ് കോവിഡ് നയൻറ്റീൻ അഫക്റ്റഡ് അസ് ഒബ്വിയസ്ലി ഒബ്വിയസ്ലി ഇറ്റ് ഹാസ് അഫക്റ്റഡ് ആൾ ഓഫ് എസ് ഇറ്റ് ഹാസ് അഡ്വേഴ്സ്ലി അഫക്റ്റഡ് അവർ പേഷ്യൻസ് ഇറ്റ് ഹാസ് അഡ്വേഴ്സ്ലി അഫക്റ്റഡ് അവർ പ്രാക്ടീസ് ആൻഡ് ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് ദ ലാസ്റ്റ് മോർ ദൻ ഫോർട്ടീൻ ഡേയ്സ് വി ഹാവ് ബീൻ കണ്ടിന്യൂസ്ലി ആൻസറിംഗ് ടു ദി ടെലിഫോൺ കോൾസ് ടു ദി മെസ്സേജസ് to the whatsapp messages as doctors we have been trained to solve the problems so we are supposed to counsel our patients and that is what we are doing we have a team we have a team already existing in our hospitals we have a 24 hours helpline and we have a diabetes tele management system a telemedicine system and during this disaster we find this extremely useful for our patients the major reason for the telephone calls were anxiety so they were anxious about diabetes patients getting covid infection and the chances of hospitalizations and more chances of death and then the question was on unavailability of medications and uh, this has been a very major concern so some of them especially the educated ones they were asking us on if the lockdown is getting extended for another one month or another two months what will happen will they be able to uh, procure the medications uh, will there be short, any shortage of medications this is because all these medications have to come from other parts of india from other parts of the world so obviously when there is no uh, transportation available Uh, so these are all difficult times these are all difficult times when we require uh, the doctor uh, himself to be answering the questions and we have to have the counselors we have to uh, train the nurses accordingly and then uh, the patients had the question on uh, doing the laboratory investigations to meet the doctor so we were not encouraging uh, direct visits we were encouraging only the uh, telemedicine visits so uh, our uh, keshavdev trust is uh, supporting uh, hundreds of children hundreds of elderly patients orphaned elderly uh, those who are uh, economically challenged and uh, for these patients we are still providing during this disaster medications and uh, treatments free of cost so i would say that the solution during this disaster will be telemedicine if you go by the definition of telemedicine the original definition it is providing medical services by a telecommunication device as the simplest it being a telephone so you, the patients require only a telephone with them if it is an ordinary telephone it can be a telephone call if they have whatsapp or facebook or if they have a skype it can be an advanced video call and if you have your own app or a telemedicine system which is running in your hospital then you can have your medical records and you can go back to the previous history and you can have projections based on the previous values so that even dosage modifications can be carried out so in this disaster during this covid times i believe that treating diabetes and managing our patients with diabetes to help them control their blood sugars to motivate them on physical activity on getting adequate rest and sleep is still possible is still possible and we need to make use of our telecommunication devices to keep in touch with the patients because patients are very important for us and this is one of the toughest times for our patients and for us we need to overcome and we will overcome 